Pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey IHS, I'm Emma Slifka and I'm Sydney Shelton and this is your Daily Dose for Monday, December 17th, 2018. You made it RHS, there are only four more days until break. Euchre Club is meeting tomorrow in the staff lounge from 3 to 4 p.m. Stop in the post to help adopt a family by donating a dollar. Don't forget to bring in baby wipes, baby powder, lifesavers, hard candy, chapstick, and toothbrushes to help FFA and Euchre Club support the military. Donations can be dropped off until Thursday in room B135. Club Picture Day will be tomorrow morning beginning at 8.15. Clubs will be called down to the auditorium in sets of three. Please make sure you come down promptly when your group is called. The list of clubs being pictured can be seen on social media via Y News or RHS. Now let's go for a hall walk. What's your favorite thing to do over Christmas break? Sleep. I'm hanging out with my friends and watch Christmas movies. What's your favorite thing to do over Christmas break? Definitely eat food and open presents if I get some. I don't think my parents will this year. Eat food and party. What's your favorite thing to do over Christmas break? All right, well, throughout this season of the year, I am super busy on my cologne grind. Come visit me at Macy's if you need to buy any cologne. So from Christmas till we get back to school, I like to chill as hard as possible. What's your favorite thing to do over Christmas break? Uh, watch Christmas movies with my family and play board games. What's your favorite thing to do over Christmas break? Hang out with my children. My favorite thing to do over Christmas break, probably just sleep, honestly. Get fat. Why Not Tea's pop-up storefront is open for one more week. What's up, RHS? So, Why Not Tea's is an apparel company ran by your fellow classmates in the marketing program. For the month of December, they have received the opportunity to have their own storefront in downtown Wyandotte. The days that are open are Wednesday through Friday, 4 to 8, and weekends, 12 to 6. Don't miss out! Teddy's has joined them selling centerpieces and wreaths, as well as flower arrangements. The shop is on Biddle, right next to R.P. McMurphy's. They are open Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday from 4 to 8. Also on Saturday and Sunday from 12 to 6. Now here's Dominic with sports. What's going on, RHS? I'm Dominic, and this is your Daily Sports Report. Swimming defeated Lincoln Park by a huge margin Thursday. Hockey played Liggett on Thursday. They lost 3-2. Freshman Josh Mills scored his first goal for the Bears. Ray Isham scored the first goal. Boys varsity basketball plays at home against Ann Arbor Prep tonight. Gr tomorrow, girls basketball plays Lincoln Park at home. The bowling faces off against Taylor. That's all for sports. Now back to you, Sydney. Thanks, Dominic. Yearbooks are on sale this week in Miss Haddad's room for $55. Prices will go up after break, so make sure you get yours. RHS's architecture class has been working on gingerbread houses for the holidays. Lately in Ms. Rankin's architectural class, they've been working on architectural gingerbread projects. I asked Ms. Rankin and some students how it's coming along. Here's what they said. What project are you doing in your architecture class? So our intermediate and advanced students are working on architectural gingerbread houses, like to scale of notable architectural landmarks or buildings. Why are you doing this project? Well, um, first of all, we thought it would be a real, like a fun thing to do during the holiday season, number one. Um, but the other thing that it kind of teaches the students is how to use like building materials, how much of a product they might need. Why are you doing this project? Um, we wanted the kids to, uh, like I said, have fun, first and foremost. Um, but we're also teaching them about the properties of scale and how you take a large set of architectural drawings and scale them down. And they also had to come up with a bill of materials for supplies that they would have to use for the project. So um, the basis of the, the whole building itself is obviously gingerbread, but then they had to figure out what they're going to make the windows out of and what they're going to make the doors out of and how they're going to embellish the project and how it's going to stand up. Do you think the students enjoy it? I do. Actually, they're doing really well. It's a group project, so I think those always go over a little bit more um, than working on something by yourself. Um, and they're having fun. It's nice to see them sitting and talking to each other. What structure are you building for this project? We are making a football stadium. Me and my partner, Matt DiMaggio, are building a cathedral. What's the name of it? The stadium is the big house where Michigan plays. St. Basil's Cathedral. Do you enjoy this project? 
I enjoy it, but it is, it's is—it's been a struggle because it's more of a tough project, so it's taken a lot longer for us to do. Looks like they've been working hard. Can't wait to see the outcome. Now back to the anchors. Such a cool project. Need a last minute? Need a last minute present for someone in your family? Teddy's is selling Christmas wreaths and centerpieces. Stop on down to check out their holiday specials. Need something cool to listen to to pass time while working during the school day? The Dot Radio is now streaming live music. Go to rhsbearedaily.com and click on the Dot Radio to listen to DJs Zach Grew and Devin Blight. They're playing all types of music. And while you're there, you can check out their podcast as well. Their most recent episode features the video game Red Dead Redemption. Tune in to the Dot Radio today. Happy birthday to everyone over the weekend, and happy birthday to Nicholas Abel. Hey, Sydney, what do you call a frog hanging from the, the ceiling? I don't know, what? A mistletoe. Stay, Stay festive, RHS. RHS.